Hello, welcome to Biology, the Sand Study of Life. Alveolitis. Uh, Alveolitis uh, have sacs pinned the plasma membrane. Another clade of protists whose identity is emerging from molecular systematics. Alveolite, the alveolitis is characterized by membrane bounded sacs, alveoli just under the plasma membrane. The function of the alveoli is unknown. Researchers hypothesize that they may help stabilize the surface or regulate the cell's water and ion contents. Alveolitis or alveolitum includes three groups a group of flagellates uh, dinoflagellates uh, a group of parasites um, um, uh, p complexins and a group of protists they move or that move by means of cilia or cilitis uh, dinoflagellates dinoflagellates uh, are bun uh, abundant components of both marine and the freshwater uh, phyto a plankton phytoplankton there are also heterotrophic dinoflagellates of uh, the several thousand known dinoflagellate species most are uh, unicellular but some are colonial uh, each has characteristic shape that in many species uh, is reinforced by internal pla uh, plates of cellulose the two flagella or flagella located uh, in uh, prependicular grooves in this uh, armor make uh, dinoflagellates from the Greek dinos whirling spins and uh, or as they move through the water. Dinoflagellate plumes uh, episodes of explosive population growth can cause a phenomenon called red tide in coastal water. The plumes appear uh, brownish, uh, red or pink, uh, pinkish, uh, orange because of the presence of uh, carto, uh, cartonoids. Notice that this uh, color. Uh, the most common uh, pigments in uh, dinoflagellate plastic toxins produced by certain dinoflagellate can cause massive kills of uh, in, uh, invertebrates and fishes. Uh, humans uh, who consume um, uh, molluscus um, that have accumulated the toxins are affected as well, sometimes fatally. Some dinoflagellates are spectacularly um, bio, uh, bioluminescent and ATP driving chemical reaction creates an eerie glow at night when waves, boats, or swimmers agitate seawater with dense populations of the dinoflagellate when possible function. Uh, of uh, this uh, bioluminescence uh, is that when the water is dist uh, disturbed uh, by organisms that feed on dinoflagellates, the light attracts fishes that eat those predators. Some dinoflagellates are uh, mutualists or uh, mutualistic uh, sampions, sampions of coral uh, polyps, uh, animals uh, that build coral reefs, the dinoflagellates photosynthetic of output. Is the main food for reef communities. Um, AP complexins. Uh, all AP complexins are parasites of animals and some cause serious human diseases. The parasites spread through their host as thin infectious cells called uh, sporozoites. Uh, um, uh, P complexins. Um, AP complexins uh, contain a complex of organs specialized for penetrating host cells and tissues. Uh, AP complexins also have a non photosynthetic plastids called the apicoloplast. Although uh, AP complexins are not photosynthetic, their apicoloplasts uh, have vital functions such as uh, the synthesis of fatty acids. Most AP complexins have uh, intricate, uh, intricate life cycles with both se sexual and asexual stages. Those life cycles often require two or more different host species for completion. Uh, for example, a plasmodium, the parasite that, co that causes malaria, live on both uh, mosquito and humans in the next page or this uh, page. Uh, 
the incidence of malaria was greatly diminished in the 1960s by the use of uh, insecticides that reduced populations of uh, Anopheles uh, mosquita, which spread the diseases and by drugs that killed uh, plasmodium in humans, but the emergence of resistance varieties of both uh, Anopheles and plasmodium has led to a resurgence of malaria. About 300 million people in the tropics are now infected and up to a million die each year from that disease. The search for malaria vaccines uh, has been hampered by the fact that plasmodium spends most of its time inside human cells hidden from the host's immune system and like uh, Tribana summer, summers uh, plasmodium continually changes its surface proteins. The urgent need for new uh, treatments for malaria inspired uh, an ambitious, uh, ambitious effort uh, of, to sequence plasmodium's genome by 23 researchers. Uh, had tracked the expression of most of the parasite genes at uh, numerous points in its life cycle. The research called uh, help scientists um, identify potentially new uh, targets for vaccines. Uh, Silites, uh, Silites, or Silites, or are a large cilia, but the group is Silites are a large varied group of protists named for their use of cilia to move and feed. The cilia may completely cover the cell surface or may be clustered in few rows uh, or tufts in certain species such as uh, stentor, notice this figure, uh, in certain species such as uh, centaur, uh, Rows of uh, tightly packed cilia function collectively in locomotion. Other cilites carry about one leg like structures. Notice that structured from many cilia bonded together. A submembrane system of micro uh, tubules co coordinates ciliary movements. A distinctive features or feature of cilites is the presence of two types of nuclei, large macronuclei and tiny um, micro uh, nuclei. A cell may have one or more nucleus of each type. Each ma macronucleus typically contains dozens of copies of ciliates genomes. The genes are not organized in chromosomes, but instead are packaged in smaller units, each bearing many duplicates of just a few genes. Macronuclear uh, nuclear genes control the everyday functions of the cell, such as feeding, waste removal, and maintaining water balance. The upper uh, portion of explores uh, these functions in the ciliate paramecium. Notice this figure that is so clear. Notice that. Okay. Uh, Silitia or Silitis generally reproduce asexually by binary fission during which the uh, macronucleus elongates and splits rather than undergoing mitotic division. Genetic variation results from conjugation, a sexual process in which two individuals exchange haploid uh, uh, micronucleus. Notice that. The conjugation and reproduction are separate processes in Silites. In 23 scientists at the Fred uh, Hutchinson or Hutchinson Cancer Research uh, Center in Seattle discovered that sexual reproduction also provides an opportunity for Silites to eliminate transposons, uh, transposons and other types of selfish DNA that can replicate within a genome. During reproduction following conjugation, foreign genetic elements are excised. Uh, when micro or micro nuclei develop into uh, macro macro nuclei, up to 15% of Silitus genome may be removed in this way every time it reproduces following conjugation. Back to the two host life cells of plasmodium, the um, AP, a complexin that causes malaria. Notice this one represents. 
um, mosquito, notice the mosquito, and affected anopheles mosquito uh, by a person injecting plasmodium sporozoites in its uh, saliva. Notice that. Notice the cycle, or notice also the cycle. Another uh, another anopheles mosquito bites the infected person and picks up. Plasmodium uh, gimito sits along um, with the blood. Notice that gimitocytes. Some uh, mirozoites from uh, gimitocytes. Notice that. And red blood cells, uh, mirozoite. Notice also liver cell and fertilization moses. Notice these are. And all cysts develops from the zygote in the wall of the mosquito's gut. The oco uh, all cysts releases thousands of uh, sporozoites which uh, migrate to the mosquito. Um, notice that salivary gland. Notice that. Okay.